here. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Is anybody there? Is there anybody out there? I don't see anyone there. <laughs> All right, hang on, because I have this thing here. You see this? I have to put the camera there. Okay. We had to do a live because I just got my hair done. Is that why? Mm -hmm. oh, now let me... It looks a little bit crazy, though. Stretch this know. out. Did you see what I was showing? That was my camera stick. It's a really good one. <laughs> and this is like a workout. Watch. Oh, it's so heavy. <laughs> Heavy. You, let's see if you can see my hand. Nobody ever shows this. What's going on here? Can you see me? Yeah, you can't see it. How can I do this? Loosen this up. There you go. See hey that? everyone! Thanks for being here. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you can actually see the stick. Okay. You like my new jeans? <laughs> Well, you can't show that because YouTube will demonetize the video. Uh -huh. Now they'll think it's a sex channel. No. Yeah. Stop it. Hey, everybody. <laughs> How is everyone? Um, Happy Monday. We, as usual, we have plenty to talk about. Not really. <laughs> 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 talk about. We just thought we'd say hi. Uh, we just... I just had a birthday. And Happy birthday! It's your birthday. She. Oh, it's his birthday. You can you can probably imagine yes, how really. nice this sweetie pie made my birthday. Ah, uh, well, I tried, but he worked all day. But it was fun. And um, it was wonderful. And I have a video forthcoming about the gift that she got me, right? Yes, unboxing. And, and it was it's an unboxing video, but. You can see it now. Can you get that thing and put it over here? This? Yeah. This thing? Yeah, that thing. That thing. Look at this. Will you look at this? <laughs> look at this. It's busy, isn't it? Oh, it is busy. Now, you, we have to be really careful because, Ow. wow, you can get cut by looking at one oh, of these. Oh, yeah, these are so sharp. This is not a sponsored video. In fact, we're not going to even tell you the brand, but... Um, but Farm Girl thought they were really cool <laughs> knives. Look at them. So share your knowledge of knives and cutlery. They're supposed to be perfectly weighted. Yeah, but there's no handle like that. It's a skeleton. It's like a skeleton. So if you'd, if you'd like to, don't cut yourself, Farm Girl. But as I say, if you want to share your knowledge of knives and other cutlery, go ahead and do so in the comments below. Yeah, so, which way would, should these be to be uh, facing in? Facing in. Yeah. So this is a wall, solid walnut uh, block. Oh yeah. And it's just lovely. And th so this thing is, you see this other knife block? This is a Henkel, this was a Henkel set. It's kind of discombobulated. Um, that's our old set. That's our old set. And I we, love this we, knife. This 30 years old. This is this is my favorite knife. Yeah, that's a really nice knife. It's a Henkel knife, and uh, it's it's thin. I like that because it's kind of it goes through things more with more ease because of the thinness, the gauge yeah. of it. It's a really good knife. This but one's really thin. Alas, mm. we don't need gadgets. Really? We don't. We're not material. No, you have turned it again. We're not. We're not really materialistic people. We live in a pretty small house, actually, um, <laughs> but. It is nice to have nice things, and I've never had a sun koto. Is that what you call it? Again, I'm I'm counting on your knowledge of knives. Kangen, Kangen, Kangen. No, no, we're not talking about the brand. Oh. We're talking about the style of knife. Oh. Knives. Yeah, and these are the steak knives. Mm -hmm. Okay. So anyway, I, I wanted we wanted to share that with you. That, but <laughs> what else did I? Get? I had to talk him into liking it. Yeah. So, <laughs> and that was, I, I have issues. You like the wrapping on like the I'm gift too bag. Like I'm too honest, and I, 
and I am remiss. He's very honest. That so. I'm not that guy that's like, oh, no matter what, I love it because you gave. I was like, oh, that that's not the one that I said I like. <laughs> it wasn't. It's better than the one. And he she said he told liked. me, she said, this is better than the one you, the, the set that you liked. And I said, oh, I, okay. I educated. So now I love it. She educated, educated me, and I love it. Yes. Look at that. We got a beautiful kitchen shears that have a bottle opener and a nutcracker. <laughs> and you know that's high grade stainless. So then, <clears throat> today, what comes in the mail? I'm, Another. I'm really edition. sorry. I'm gonna I'm gonna start watching and try to see if I can read what. Jen, can you read anything that people are saying? No. Maybe? Well, oh. yeah. I love this girl. Ah, who said that? Oh, it went away. Well, let me get my glasses. All right, <laughs> never mind. Okay. So well, we'll do that in a sec. So I turned 57. In case you're curious. 57. <laughs> And I thought, and I, and I got an extra year for my birthday, which was really cool. Yeah, I, he thought he was turning 58. <laughs> you, know, you know how when they, you get up way up in the double digits, you're like, wait, what am I again? You know, <laughs> I thought I was turning 58, and I was a little bit depressed. And I thought, wait, you can't get depressed about getting older. What, what, do you, what else, what's the alternative, right? Yeah. Exactly. So then we got this package in the mail. And I'm look, a very good friend. Look what a, my my brother, my, my friend. I call him my brother. He's he's a, a friend of mine. That you kind of. And he sent me this thing that Ow. farm girl can't get out of the package. <laughs> uh, I hope we haven't missed any super chats. I know people do that. <laughs> no, sometimes. you and Sam and Tom. Um, it's a wine opener, and you all probably have seen these many times. Oh, but oh yeah. This is a rabbit, I guess. And, and look what else. Oh. And, and there's a note. It looks like a rabbit. And my buddy's name is Jim, and I call him Jim Bobway. That's, a, that's my little pet name for him. And so he said, happy birthday, brother. Enjoy, Jim Bobway. Nice. That was really cool. That's awesome. Now, he's, so, he's such a classy guy. He doesn't just send me... <laughs> an opener, but he sends me a wine saver with you know, a bunch of one of those the plus or the yeah. rubber corks that you yeah. can suck the air up. These things you sucks the air out of your wine, so it preserves it. Because if you don't do that, your wine oxidizes and it tastes like. And we don't mess. drink red wine a lot, but we like to have a little bit every <clears throat> once in a while. So yeah. if you leave a bottle sitting there for two days, it doesn't taste good. But right. if you do this, so better. do you know how to use that? I think so. Let's open that expensive bottle of wine that our electrician gave it. Our electrician sold us. <laughs> I have a young electrician. I had a young electrician, and he he uh, he right. said he kept telling me he was going to give me a bottle of wine. I said, "Well, you should sell that bottle of wine," because he said it was hundreds of dollars, and he wasn't going to drink it. And I said, "Oh, thank you." What? Oh boy, I can't see the name. Uh, Somebody just did a $10 super chat, and I can't read oh, the name. Okay. Thank you so much for that. What was that? I would, I'm telling a story, but I want to say to thank you to uh, Oscar Torres. Thank, thank you, you Oscar. sir. That was very kind. You the man. Okay. So, Look, so. I love these things. This young man said he was gonna he was gonna give me this bottle of wine, and then I said, "No, you should sell it if it's if it's, if it's a couple hundred. Look how small it is. Oh, she just tiny. We, are we showing that? Ooh. And yeah. so he comes to do a job for me, and he brings this bottle of wine, and and then it's the job. It's Fort de la Tour. The job we we monkeyed around for a few hours on it, but uh, because I took him to the store and we bought some wire and stuff, and then. He runs a wire and he charges me three hundred and twenty dollars for one for a twelve foot for running a twelve foot wire and I was like, whoa. which you helped him do? Which I and I was his helper. He didn't bring a helper and I was like, whoa, shit. <laughs> just we just bought a bottle of wine because this one asks him the price when I wasn't in the room. I told her don't do that. So anyway, <laughs> he sold me a bottle of wine is what he did. Three hundred and twenty dollars for. You know he's gonna see this. Oh yeah. Well, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> well, then he'll know why I don't want to, don't want to hire him. Um, Ooh. Nice kid. Nice guy. I like him. He's, He's a nice, guy. nice guy. But, All right. Yeah, you don't. No, three hundred and twenty. Rabbit. Bucks for. Him. Yep. Place the rabbit. All right. Are we watching? Right. 
I don't know. So th anyway, let's show this wine before you. you I don't know how to do this. I thought I'd, oh yeah. Place the rabbit like this, okay. right? All right. Right? You say so. And then push down. All the way down, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. Pull up. Nope. You didn't do it right. But it did go down in there. What am I doing wrong? <laughs> <laughs> you, Somebody you won't help be able me. to read that anyway. All right, here. Thank you again, you Mr. Torres, for the for the ten dollar super chat. We really appreciate. Oh yeah, it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh yeah. Well, that's a really old bottle, right? Got it. All right. So what do we have here? It's uh, Le Fort de la Tour, two thousand five. Do you want to sniff the? Wow, how old were you in 2005, Farm Me? Girl? 10, 13 years ago. Let me sniff. 40. It. You were 40. No, 39. That's 39. Wow. It's Look how saturated that cork is. Yeah. Isn't that, is that, isn't good? that interesting? Or is that bad? It just, it's old and it's been stored properly, right? It's been laying down. Mm hmm. Right? Mm hmm. So, anyway. I guess we should drink that. Our electrician got this from a very wealthy client. He wasn't going to drink it, so he sold it to us. <laughs> uh, we were like, no, sell it. You should sell it. I wish I wish I had a hit stuck to my guns on that. Because then, <laughs> you know? then I would have gotten two hundred a, 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 a 12-foot wire for $200. Well, you might okay. be pleasantly surprised right now. Let's see. So we're going to share. We're going to have a little sip of I this. I think we should let it. You know. All right. All right. So what else do we want <laughs> do to talk about? Do its thing. And so here's another thing that happened that was really cool. It's how materialistic. We're talking about things. Things. My well, it's our birthday, neighbors. So. Our neighbors gave us a stove that's nicer. Oh yeah. It's like it's like this only only nicer. Only it comes out to like here. Yeah, it's a little bit big for the trailer. So we brought it to our trailer, and it's just beautiful. Uh, but it's a glass top stove. And so we have a rental trailer that's turning into the Taj Mahal. All right. And uh, is that it? We just were doing a live for fun and wanted to say hello to you all. Yeah, because I got my hair done and we're and not going out. So can't be <laughs> we're going out with you very guys. Very many people here because we're not saying a whole lot. <laughs> California wine has arsenic. What? Uh, Robert said. And then Arthur said LOL. Oh. Okay. So, it says a Chicago wine merchant selection. All right. Does anybody have any questions while we're chatting? Because people have questions and we have... Well, yeah, they've probably been streaming questions. And we have we're... not spent enough time... Can you see that? We have not spent enough time with... We, it's hard to answer questions because we're very busy and, we, uh, and we're trying to make videos. Oh, look at that. Somebody super, just super chatted. No, it was, a, yeah, a euro, I think. called super something. Let's see who that was. Super. Super. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much for that. Super L. For that super chat. Does everybody see? Can people see that? Yeah. <laughs> super K to... Super Click Cats. Thank you very much for that. That was very, very sweet. Very Thank thoughtful. you. All right. So, what was I saying? You were saying, do you have any questions? Oh yeah. Do a bikini. All right. Let me t let me let me say something. We we do we we're, we're always interested in what people think we should be doing, oh, at, yeah. at, at, in terms of content. What, like we do what the hell we want, but when it comes to content, we want to entertain this audience that we have. So, I we did a, a poll, uh -huh. and we wanted to see what people preferred, and that we put. Like the travel. Things that we do. We do travel. We do cooking. cooking we do comedy. Some we try to do ha! comedy. Hank we and do, Roxy. We do <laughs> we do how tos, and we do reviews and unboxings, and we do the you know yeah, kind we, of the gamut. Like chat with people. But uh, we interviews. 
interviews, right, and we'd like to do more of that. But we like variety because that is our, our culture, that is our lifestyle. Yeah. Yeah. We love variety in all things, and uh, so it, it's fun for us, but it, it occurred to us that, hey, that maybe you guys maybe we should hone it different. down to what these people want and not yeah. just it's not just about us and what we like to do. So if you will take a look at that poll, it is on our community tab, and I don't know how you guys access that, but there's our videos. If you go into the Banshee Moon page, you can go to videos and you can go to community and look at that poll and tell us what your preferences are. Hello in Spain, Javier. Greetings from Did I say it right? Javier? Javier. 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 Hello in Spain. Epstein didn't kill us. <laughs> <I> think. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there no. are some really good memes about that. Yeah, there are some really good. And oh, what's the deal with cats and salami? Is Farm what girl I is know. obsessed with the cats and salami. Thing. So she, now, like every other meme that I see on Instagram, so and I guess it might just be who we follow. But the the person who came up with that wanted you to be dazzled and wowed and not know what the hell was good. disoriented they, so they disoriented you i was at work the other day and asked a few people and they just looked at me like i was crazy so she wakes up and looks at uh instagram and there's all these memes about cats eating salami and yes it's just so you can give your cat some salami it's okay to give your cat salami like what and he'll be fine so that's like a new thing so it's apparently a quote from a movie or something yeah Oh, Epstein so didn't kill himself. It is so funny to look at you from the other side, looking at them. Hi. Oh, that Seeing your big eye. <laughs> is that funny, guys? What? Somebody said they're friends with our son. Oh. Well, yeah. I have to go back and read that. I can't find it. Right there. I'm friends with your son and live in the area. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> all right. Well, thank thank you all for being here while we ramble yeah. incessantly. Uh, anything else? There were other things we, we we can talk about. We have a bunch of coffee that just got delivered, so it's fresh. I mean, it's always fresh, but like this is really fresh. Smell this. Oh, it smells so good. When I go to the post office. We love it because they smell that coffee that I'm shipping out and you, it's just like amazing aroma. Can you smell it? Yeah. It's just the richest, most beautiful, bold, yes. lovely essence you've really ever is, yeah. experienced. Oh. It's so awesome. So, so you can order some on Etsy. Etsy.com slash shop slash Banshee Moon. Okay. You can get a calendar. 2020 calendar. Oh yeah, you have a there. lot of people... Go in the comments and uh, on videos and on lives like this where you say this and they say, where can I get a calendar? No, there's people on Etsy that say, where I want to get a calendar. And I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> I can't help you. <laughs> okay. I, I can't come push a button for you. <laughs> but thank you all. Uh, Farm Girl enjoys selling hundreds. There's... Yeah. You sold so many cameras. Uh, Let's try this. Yeah, I think it's been breathing long enough. So, <laughs> it's kind of cold, and I don't like cold red wine. Yeah, I don't either. It's Well, it's in the, it's like 50 degrees, 56 degrees. No, oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. so we're going to try La Forte. La Forte, I Somebody guess. Somebody said play your guitar again. Actually. I guess F-O-R-T-S is Fort. La Forte de la Tour. Skeeter in the swamp, get <laughs> off of my back, cause I can't take it no more. Wow. I wrote that in the uh, swamp. <laughs> in the 80s. I call it Skeeter in the swamp. I'm not kidding. I really wrote that. Skeeter in the swamp. Little joke. I entertained my brother with that when we were drinking. Cheers. Cheers. I'm a little bit afraid. Hang on, let's sniff it. Smells pretty good. Smells it. Smells it. Mm. Smile even though, even if you don't like oh, it. Oh, I like it. You it's do? delish. Yeah. It's very smooth. I don't like it. I think if it was like warmer, it. it would be a really good um, steak one. 
Yeah, let's get some steak. <gasps> we have steak. Why? Because it's the day after my birthday. It's his birthday week. And we have, <laughs> and we have steak knives. So, um, what else? I had a question. I had a question for people. Um, oh yeah, and it's cold here, so I don't have my bikini on. And I've been wearing my jeans, so I have jean lines. I work with a coffee company. <laughs> sells equipment, and coffee. Offices in Jackson, but we would love to chat about being able to push your coffee uh, to a local taster. That'd be awesome. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, send us an email. We'll bring you and, some coffee and inquire again when I can understand more. It's uh, Banshee Moon Studio, Studio at Gmail dot com. And please don't, please people don't send text to say hello because we that is email. email. <laughs> and I'm, it's all the same. It's technology, technology. whatever. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thank you for wanting to say hello, but please yeah, don't send yeah, text. Yeah. Don't, don't send messages to say hello. That, that's what we can do that in the comments. Because um, a lot of people just find their email and just get loaded. Up. But yeah, if you have a business inquiry that's serious like that, we'd love to hear from you. <laughs> Ah, being blind is not good. I know. I mean, we're sorry, guys. It's hard for us to see. That's that's insensitive to the blind because I don't know what being blind is like. Yeah, but it's going by really half, fast. Half blind. Oh, there's, yeah. Okay. Something Eric. about the metal detector. Yeah. Okay. We'll we'll read that <laughs> later. But I've seen it a few times. Just hold that thought, okay? Yeah, we need to do more metal detecting. We yeah. haven't done that in a while. All right, we'll go back and check. That oh, maybe out. that's what he's saying. We want to see you do more metal, metal. Yeah, detecting. well, he's saying he wants to do stuff like that with us. Cool. Okay. And yeah, we didn't put um, shooting guns or shooting stuff because YouTube that hates doesn't really that. Good. That uh, what is that amendment gives gives the right to bear arms? They don't yeah. like that. They it's don't, like they don't appreciate being that. Squished, so they squash. They like to quash that kind of thing. <laughs> so we'll we'll find a place to put videos like that. Yeah. What was that? <laughs> Actually, oh, okay. metal detected. Well, hey, Aaron. Okay. Oh, cool. All right. Awesome. We'll, we'll talk He's the sweetest boy ever yeah. in life. We love him. <laughs> so, all right. Um, there's only... What? There's only so much to talk about, so I think we're done, right? Are we done, Posley? Got anything just wanted, to add? We just wanted to say hi to everybody Where? and uh, let's see if we wanted to know if you have questions, but we can't see what you're saying. So we <laughs> under my glasses. We we need to set it up like we usually do, uh, so that we can see on the computer. But I like to do these handheld lives where we can walk around. Yeah, but we haven't walked around. <laughs> 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 All right. Oh, I can kind of see from here. Where's Bob? Bob is at. There we go. Farm. That's a good question. Hey, Bob. Yeah. He he lives on the farm because he loves farm life, and we didn't want yeah. to take him out of there. Bob, if you haven't hey, heard. Hey, Sergeant Dino from Chicago. If you haven't heard our story about Bob. Sucks you're blind because your wife is so beautiful. No, I can see my wife because she's right here and she's not a, not fine print. <laughs> um, Our coffee comes from Kenya and Costa Rica and, right now. Uh, and yeah. and a number of other places. Yeah. But Bob is our farm cat that we, we were out playing with one day on the farm and then we went inside and then 20 minutes later, Bob came to the door bleeding from his eye. Like Birding and his blood. eye was pushed to one side because some awful. jackass shot him with a pellet gun right between the eyes on the one side, and it went in behind his eye and pushed his eye out. Yeah, so we had we had to spend awful, a lot of awful. money over and over. Poor little guy. Trips to the to the vet. Yeah. Happy the, Happy Thanksgiving to everybody. Thank you, Clint. I appreciate the birthday wishes. Yeah. And uh, hello in the Philippines. Uh, mm -hmm. Do do need no, more? We no, need we more don't cats. need any more cats. <laughs> in fact, 
So I love animals. I love all animals, but I would never was really a cat person. I love this animal. But so Bob just found me and Let's see. I if we had to somebody was asked if he was mine as soon as as soon as he came out from the woods, I was yes. like, oh, I have to have that kitty. Yes, we have pork butt. There's some pork butt in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah? You want to eat that. Oh, it's already cooked. Yeah. Somebody was asking cooked if we and have, frozen. And we have videos about cooking pork, Happy birthday. smoking Happy pork butt. Happy birthday. Thank you for the Aww, birthday wishes, thank guys. Thank you, everybody. Happen. Uh, YouTube's going to monetize you. What? Somebody said something about people you have to try this coffee you're missing out yeah oh, thank, thanks thomas thank you thomas thanks for buying the coffee it's, it's really really good coffee we're, we're del delighted with it yeah we've been drinking both the moon girl, and the dark i like the dark she was in the uh, she was in the coffee business 30 she started 30 years ago right mm -hmm. a little over 30 years ago in the coffee business and why we, are you looking over your glasses <laughs> do you grind the beans? Yes, we grind the beans. Yep, we sell uh, well, whole. Yeah, roasted. we sell whole beans because that way it stays fresher. Yeah. Longer. And you can and request espresso roast. We have we we market dark and light, dark and no, we market dark and medium. Yeah. Medium is called middle moon, and dark is called the dark side of the moon. I prefer finely ground. How you guys live. Well, yeah, so if you grind your own, you can just keep happy, grinding it and grinding it. Happy holidays and Merry Christmas. Let's discuss that uh, holidays thing. That person just said happy holidays, and I'm fine with that. Because they were, to me, they're referring to, don't get excited, just hear me out. <laughs> to me, they're referring to, they're grouping Thanksgiving and Christmas. Exos dead. Right? Yeah. So that's fine, but let us not forget that Christmas is Christmas, and and, and I, we're not. I, I don't we don't care. go to church I mean, and we're stuff not like that. We're not, and we're, we're not, not religious. We're none of those things. But let's honor people in their culture. If somebody's Christian and they celebrate the day Christ was born, say Merry Christmas to them. Say Merry Christmas. Yeah. Happy holidays is fine, but let's not lose the whole Christmas thing. I'm not political about. It. I don't want to be political, but it irritates me when people are like, "Yeah, no, it's I mean, Xmas, it's just, and yeah. we're not saying Christmas." That's just so. Okay, do that to the Muslims. It's just the kind of butt hurt thing, you know. Yeah, people, people have to be people dramatic. Have, yeah, and people have to be triggered. Like, it's all right. True that. We're good with but, whatever but, you guys uh, want to do. Thank you very much, uh, Doyce. Is that? Did that say Doyce? An oh, one. Jeremiah, thanks for buying the coffee. Wait, uh -oh, what did he uh -oh. say? What'd you do? I had to see what Jeremiah said. Doyce. I like that name. Doyce Bear. Oh, he said it's the best coffee he's had. Yay! Well, thank, thank you. you. We got so many good reviews on our coffee. It's like we the tasted bomb. a lot of different ones. We yeah. should have done a video while we were tasting. Well, it's one of those things it where we don't make money on it because it's really expensive. But we have a passion for coffee, and one day we will because everybody's gonna everybody's gonna want this coffee. Yeah. Donny Ote, will you still be doing these videos in ten years from now? Hell yeah! I, I hope so. He said, <laughs> "Yeah, we hope so." But we're old. We're old. You know, we're, we're not old. But if you guys will stick with us, we surely will. Crazy. Thank you, guys. In ten years, you're only going to be sixty-seven. Not bad at all. That's young. My mom's what seventy-seven. What color is the? Hello, and Dad. Hello, Mike. And they're doing great. I agree, one hundred percent, Exo Man. Christmas. Hey, thing. Lonnie T. Yeah. Good to see you. Yeah. Say have. Ha, yeah, have a pair. We love you too, Don. Have a pair. Grow up, people, and. If it's if it's Christmas and it's because of Christ, Aww, and all that, so call sweet. it what it is. No, mm -hmm. Don't be a jackass. It's those dirty minds. Yeah. What? And that sounded like I was insulting. I wasn't insulting the person that said Happy Holidays. Again, if you want to say no, that, that's hell fine, no. But yeah. Don't, hell, don't, hell no. Don't be mean <laughs> to the Christians. See what you want, people. What did that Same person say? Same age as us. Congrats. Thank you. Nice to see. Bird. Oops. Well, it, I try to push my finger on here and it doesn't do anything. You see what I'm trying to do? 
Hate when people call Thanksgiving Turkey Day. <laughs> Aw. Turkey Trot Thanksgiving. Yay. Yeah. But Thanksgiving, you should call it Thanksgiving because it's giving thanks. Thanks again, Don, for the and for the shout out for the coffee. I appreciate that. I love giving thanks because it makes you feel good. Like yeah. Where you should think about all the good things in your life. We were our beautiful, neighbors, our beautiful neighbors shared breakfast with us this yes. morning. They invited so us over sweet. and they said grace. So and yeah. we don't, we don't, like I said, we're not church people. We're not religious, but we are but we that. Do. Yeah, of course. That's, of course. that's, that's giving thanks. And that's exactly we what give, we do. But we do. We thank the food and we, we're, we're just thankful. We're just we're thankful. Grateful. You need yeah. to be grateful because if you don't, if you're not grateful, you don't experience abundance. That's just the rules of the universe. But it just makes you feel good to be thankful and happy. Can you tell I'm frustrated with the dishes? <laughs> <laughs> like taking them on. I'm out. missing all of these. Aww. Thanks for the entertaining videos. Thank you, Robert Anderson. Hey, Luke, that's what I always say. How was your day? I'm 70. He's like, how do you think my day was? <laughs> Sergeant Dino, <laughs> dark roast coffee. Heck yes, we have that. Go to uh, Etsy.com slash shop slash Banshee Moon. Sergeant Dino said, I'm 70 and I'm still having fun. Do you, oh, remember, do you remember when you were a kid and yeah. you thought, oh man, when I'm old, I'm not going to have any fun anymore. It's going to yeah, suck. Yeah, but we used to think 30 would be old. Oops. And then you get this age and you're like, oh man, I got a lot of living left to do. Heck yeah. I was thinking so, about that today. I was talking 70, to some ladies that were 75 and yeah. 78. When you're 70. And they're amazing. Like out having fun, making plans for the night. Mm-hmm. Uh, just, uh, I was like, crap, I, I mean, not crap, good. I have 25 years till I'm that age, and that seems like a long time. Like, that's Walker's age from now. Mm -hmm. That's a Walker's age. I mean, age. It, it goes fast, but that's awesome. So if there's I any like we have younger people out there fun. watching, don't don't think that you're not going to enjoy Victor. your life when, <laughs> Good you're, to see when you, you get older. Take care of yourself so that you can enjoy your life, and you sure as hell will. Yeah. Hey, Brian from Kentucky. Hello, in Kentucky. In 1981, I yeah, never 1958, thought of 2019. You never thought of 19. I remember thinking, I'm going to be 30 in what year? In 2000. Wait. How old were you when you thought that? When I, when I was young. Oh. I, don't know. Like we're gonna, I just kept thinking, I'll be 30 in. Okay. We're gonna do a video. No, 1996. I said to I said to Farm Girl, we need to do another video about stuff that we remember, like the pay phones and oh, all yeah, that. Oh yeah, like and old, we're watching the old times. <laughs> the old times. It really wasn't that long ago, but with the brick phones. When we go back, when I you know I remember stuff 50 50 years ago, 40 years ago, that would blow people's minds. My mom used to do this to me. She would tell me about how she learned to drive in a Model T and all that stuff. And, and now, they had like tin cans, like real got, tin cans. How exciting what it was when they got the telephone, you know, <laughs> in the house. But didn't they? In the, yeah, yeah. In the it, 30s. But um, Jen and I were watching TV and uh, Terminator was on. Oh. And they were looking through a phone book. The Terminator was looking through a phone book to find his Sarah, target. Sarah Connor. Sarah Connor. <laughs> and I remembered, oh, crap. We used to have our numbers in the phone book with our address. Yeah. It said Anybody our Anybody could just full, look you up and find you. It said our full name, and then it said our address, and then our phone number. And then those and then, weirdos that wanted to be unlisted. Sometimes. <laughs> And so you would dial, Smart. you guys remember this, you would dial on the phone, on the pay phone or whatever, 411 to get a number. You'd say, hey, the operator would answer and you would say, I need a number for so-and-so. And every now and then they'd say, I'm sorry, Rhonda's number is unlisted. And I would say, what? <laughs> how can you be unlisted? How exclusive. Yeah, how so, rude. <laughs> that's pretty, that's pretty like, funny. you don't want me to call you? Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, things we, we things internalize we're, things. We're gonna have to do a video about that, about things we remember <laughs> from the old days. Hi, Klein. Thank you, Klein. Hi, Jim. Oh, if you wanted to be unlisted, you had to pay for it. Yeah, exactly. Oh, it was, it I was, didn't know yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. It was that's... like it was extortion. Yeah, that does yep. not seem right. Yeah, it was like in a little elitist thing. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So if you can't afford it, you can't be unlisted. I mean, that was so wrong. It like, is really wrong. Like they were doxing you and extorting money from you if you didn't want to be doxed. Yeah. Can you imagine how that would fly today? No. 
Oh, mm -hmm. hell no. So we got to talk about that in our video about the old days. Yeah. Come to Mardi Gras. You'll love it. Oh, we love Mardi hey, Gras. Hey, let me, let me well, tell we you. we basically, well, we met in New Orleans, and we went to... T, that's I don't know, probably T. eight Mardi Gras in a row. T, that is where all my kin is from, and we're talking 150, 200 years of, of roots back there. Yeah. And I uh, I went to Mardi Gras in the early, early 70s, and Glenn Campbell was so drunk, and <laughs> I was I had vi got to visit with my father, who I rarely saw, and I was on his shoulders. I tell the story mm -hmm. a lot. And I, and I said, I looked up to the float, and I said, hey, Glenn! Throw me something, Glenn. Throw me some beads. And Glenn Campbell's like, oh, 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 swaying. He's drunk. And he leans over. And he, he's looking for, he says, I'm, I don't have anything left. And his crown falls off of his head and into my arms. He was the rhinestone cowboy, so he was king of Bacchus. So he wore a rhinestone And you suit. had to fight some lady for it, right? <laughs> for... Ladies, well, I wouldn't call them ladies. Like, <laughs> give me that crown! Give me that crown! And they jumped on my father, and my father was kicking, throwing his knee into these women, and he went and pushing through the crowd. And I had Glenn. He was a rhinestone cowboy. And then what happened? He had a rhinestone scepter, and he had a rhinestone the, the Bacchus crown. And then I was like, I was a little kid, and I thought you're supposed to, you know, give it back. So I said, Dad, should I give it back to him? And he said whatever you want. And so we walked to the float and I said, Mr. Campbell. And I threw the camp crown back to him. Boy, what a good boy People you wanted are. to kill us for that. Aw, oh. such a nice boy. See, he would have gotten in trouble if he went back to the place without his crown. Come down. Yeah, uh, I'm sorry about this. We're going, the next time we're going to do a live, we're going to do it sans the reading glasses and on the computer so we yeah, can see it's so what you guys are saying. This way. We're sorry. So, all right, we've talked too much. But we, we let's, let's go to Mardi Gras. You want to go to Mardi Gras? Somebody said, I don't know. Uh, somebody <laughs> said they missed getting the calendar. What does that mean? It's, it's not even 2020 yet. Oh, yeah. We have the 2000. Have, she has 2019 and she has 2020. I have some 2018s, 2019s, and 2020s. I have more 2019s and 2018s than I do 2020s. <laughs> but we'll order more if we need to. I'm kind of digging the wine a little bit now that it is warm. Yeah, it's, I knew that you would like it. But I, I don't know. And you have a steak. All right, let's save the rest of it. There's not much in this little bottle. Actually, this is a very large bottle. I just have this is huge, a perfect bottle for huge us. hands. <laughs> you know what, what they say, huge what? hands, warm heart. <laughs> is that what I mean, say? her heart. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? No. <laughs> oh, oh, sorry we missed you in Chicago. So, yeah, anyway. So... Any more, any more yeah, questions? Luke, Luke got what I was saying. <laughs> Just a, <roundabout>. <laughs> <laughs> a little roundabout thing there. Um, so maybe we'll see you guys in, in uh, New Orleans for Mardi Gras. Duplin County. I don't like Duplin County, but it, only because I just don't like sweet wine. Neither of us like sweet wine. We like dry wine, but Crazy it's uh, it's supposedly very good wine. And they do make some wine that's dry, but. We just don't see much of it. All right. Good night, Danilo. Uh, thank you for joining us. Goodbye. Who was that? We'll see you guys soon. We thank love you all. Love you all. Thank you for joining thank us. Thank you so much for thank joining you, us. Martin, Danilo, David. Mwah. Good night from Rome. Where did, what did that person say? Ciao, Bella. There was one more question there that I didn't address. Uh, where did you find this exo man? Oh, we found each other in, in New Orleans. <laughs> at Fat Harry's. Yeah. We were kids. We were kids. And we ate. Uh, I was a teenager. We Whoa. ate big plates of cheese fries. Oh God! And fried chicken, chicken wings. Crispy, crispy chicken oh, wings the done right. Best chicken wings. And, the, and ever. it was called Fat Harry's, and it was right next door to uh, Cape or to Paul. Uh, Mike, Al Copeland's restaurant. Copeland's. Copeland's. Yeah. And, uh... Copeland's is delicious. Copeland's was... Al Copeland was the guy that started Popeye's Fried Chicken. 
when he was a young dude in the late 60s, early 70s. And he wanted a fine restaurant, so he opened Copeland's, and Paul Perdone wrote the menu for him. So a little bit of trivia. Everybody's gone now. R.I.P. Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan is awesome. What happened to Joe Rogan? What? Are you serious? We love Joe Rogan. Don't say that. Yeah. Now we gotta go look, go Google him. Oh, God. Fat Harry's to find farm girls. He's off. <laughs> I don't yeah. know if it's still open. We brought the kids oh, yeah. here. It's open. All right. It's gotta be open. They cannot close. Love, love, to, Fat love to you all. Thank you for joining Mwah. us. We'll see you soon. Okay? Love you all. Bye. Have a great night.